Hi, this is your girl Blair's Mom One. This is my first video for YouTube, but I was inspired to post it because I had been watching so many YouTube uh, videos and never really saw a whole lot of them that started off at the, the, the level I'm at. This is three weeks after my BC. Um, I'm going to do another one next week so I can start chronicling it monthly. But I want to get on here today just to talk about a couple of products I've, I've um, established as my staples in this little period of time. Because I'm already a product junkie, I realize that. Um, if I could show you, and I'm probably going to edit it so that you can see my little closet, it's ridiculous. Um, shorter to long, I had a lot of hair. I kept cutting it shorter, shorter, shorter because the, the, the perm was breaking my hair off. The relaxer was chewing at it and breaking it off. So I was uh, cutting it shorter, keeping it cute. But one day, my stylist cut it really, really short. I kept getting it shorter and shorter. I always wanted the big chop. It wasn't gutsy enough to go there yet. My stylist did it really, really short. She cut it too short, as a matter of fact. So it was super cute coming from the salon. But like a couple of days out, when I had sweated it out a little bit, I couldn't get. I didn't have. Um, I didn't have the iron to to cut to curl it back. So I said, you know what? It was Labor Day, and I said, you know what? Off with it. I'm t I'm taking it off. So a couple days later, I decided. Three days later, I went to the barber and had him cut it. He cut it with clippers. Um, it was a shock. Even though I had worn my hair short, I had never worn it short on the top, and it was a boy's haircut. Um, and it took some getting used to. I had to learn how to, no matter what, because I would just throw a cap on or some earrings and run out. But now I had to really put some purpose in my look because I was had taken my hair off. Anyway, I saw a video on on um, YouTube, Shakira Renee. Shout out to Shakira Renee. Hey. And she was documenting her hair growth. She was one of the few that had it at that length, and her hair was beautiful. But I noticed she said something that, like, three weeks after her initial, she went for another BC because her hair was so dry. I was having tremendous problems with my hair, and I didn't know if it was a transition. Well, there was no transition. I didn't know if there was, because it was, I didn't know what the problem was. I just knew my hair was really, really dry, and I was like, man, I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't want to put no more relaxer on it. I don't want to cut it again, but I was going to cut it again. And then I thought about it. I went to the products I had been using, and I was using Organics, um, Coconut Milk, um, Shampoo and Conditioner. And I was co-washing it every day. So I said, let me see what the review is on Organics. I started seeing these reviews, and everybody was tripping, saying how bad it was. I mean, some women were saying it was good, but a lot of sisters were saying how it dried their hair out. And one woman even said something that I had experienced. When she was in the shower washing her hair, her hair felt dry in that spot while it was still conditioning water in it. So I knew that that wasn't for me. I already deal with dry scalp, so I didn't need anything that was going to dry me out more. And that particular product did. So I thought maybe she should stay away from all that protein and a little of the coconut. But um, nevertheless, I was told about a conditioner and shampoo from my cousin who's natural. She's been natural for three years. And she was telling me to go ahead and knock it out, get you some good stuff, girl. Now, I'm trying to go expensive because I'm thinking you get what you pay for. Well, let me tell you what I got and what is awesome, and you all know about it already, and some of y'all hate it. Some of y'all absolutely love it. I am on Team Hello Hydration. It is just the bomb. I can't say enough good stuff about it, baby. This stuff here... And the smell of it, for those of you who don't know, because I, I know most of y'all know, but for those of you who don't know, it's tolerable. I have used products, and you, if you feel it, you move your head around, and you smell it, and it's just like at the end of the day, it's like, come on. I'm tired of smelling this, but not this. This is what is up. Hello Hydration, moisturizing shampoo. It leaves your hair feeling clean, but not like it's stripped, and it still feels a little moisturized, but... Not like a conditioner, but feels good. This right here. <sighs> my hair, I was going to cut it, y'all. I was going to cut it. This saved my hair life. Thank you. This is what's up. And then after that, I used, I got this from African Exports. The Garnier Fructis. This is a, a frizz dry for damaged hair and I had all of that 
Maybe not the frizz because it wasn't long enough for frizz, but I had damaged hair apparently, or maybe not even damaged. It was very, but it was very, very, very dry. And both of these things together, the um, Hello Hydration, can't say enough good things about it. Hello Hydration conditioner and the Fruit Tea Sleek and Shine um, cream. That's really good. And of course. I threw in the African Shea Butter for good measure. The real Shea Butter. I don't use the Cantu Shea Butter Cream because it, it left a white residue in my hair. I know a lot of the naturals love it. But I also found out that you, it's not about what you want to use or what you love. It's about what your hair loves. I got a headband on. I'm trying to rock it right now. It's really my first time wearing it. Um, my hair is going really at a good rate. I was really short. I had really short hair. Um, it always grows pretty good. I don't know about the texture. Check it out for me. It's not wet or nothing, so you ought to be able to tell what kind of texture it is. I don't really know. I'm thinking a 3C, but I'm new to it. But I'm thinking 3C. I don't know. 4A maybe. Check me out. Let me know. But I will come back next week, and then I'll chronicle monthly. Thank y'all for watching. Remember, rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. God bless you. Good night.